Hey everybody, it's Matt from Rails Productions. This is the first of hopefully many video editing tutorials that we're going to be doing for uh, Final Cut. And we're going to be doing some pretty basic tutorials for beginners. So the first one that I'm going to be doing today is how to do a little color correction and white balancing in Final Cut. This is good for a lot of people that don't have maybe a, a nice camera that you know you can white balance or maybe you're using a, a a webcam to record your videos and you wanna do a little color correction so to begin as you see on uh, in my canvas here I have a, a clip and it's a little bit red um, to correct that I'll go over here to the color corrections tab and I'm gonna select the color corrector three-way Select that and drag that down to my clip. As you can see, it shows up in the viewer here under the filters. You're going to want to click visual so you get the three color wheels here. Now under the white color wheel, there's the little eyedropper. You're going to select the little eyedropper and come over to your canvas and select something that is white. In this case, it's the shirt that he's wearing and click on it. And as you can see, the color gets changed a little bit. It's a little bit more natural. Um, but I want to fix it just a little bit more. That doesn't really make me too happy here. I mean, it's a good start, but I want to fix this a little bit. It's still a little dark. So I'm going to go under the white color circle here. Just raise this a little bit. Under the mids here, just raise this a little bit too. Um, obviously, this depends on your project, whatever the look you're going for. Um, just you're gonna want to play with you know all the all the levels here um, even maybe even the saturate maybe you want to saturate the color just a little bit um, I think that looks pretty clean and that is really just a really simple tip to you know improve the look and color of your video especially like I said if you're using a, uh, a webcam just drag it into uh, import it into Final Cut I hope this quick tip might have helped some people out um, don't forget to subscribe Again, this is Matt from Rails Productions.